Morning, guys. Yeah, so competition starts at 9 o'clock this morning, and it is going all week long. There are exhibitors here from all over the world as young as 6 years old and as old as late 80s. So we actually have a junior exhibitor here with us from Florida. We have um, uh, Alexa, can you tell me a little bit about what exactly is going on here this week for you? Yes, this week is the World Championship Horse Show, and I show in the junior exhibitor country pleasure division 14 to 17 and you have a partner in crime that you've been with for yes, quite a while can you introduce me yes, to mo and i, I haven't pronounced his um full name properly yet because so can you yes it is champion undulata satchmo and so i'm looking at a flyer here and this yes. says last dance what does that mean that means that this show this year is our last competition that we're having together wow and it's been six years so this is our last time on the green shavings and then we're having a retirement ceremony at the World Equestrian Center in Ocala in that's, October. That's really cool. You yeah. said that Mo is absolutely spoiled. You're actually getting ready his, one of his favorite treats. What is yeah. this? This is Gatorade. <laughs> this is one of his favorite things because he's spoiled rotten. So why Gatorade? Is it because like hydrating ourselves too? Yes and in Florida it's super hot but these electrolytes are good after a workout. Oh my gosh, oh. so he's just gonna sit there and drink yes. up. Talk to me a little bit about y'all's history together, what you, what all you've accomplished. We started in 2017 when we got here. We won, at, we got Reserve World at Louisville. Then the next year we won both classes. Then the next year I got second and we won the next class. But honestly, wow. In 2021, we won both classes, but that's not what it's important. Just spending every day with him is my favorite thing. Can you talk to me a little bit about your relationship? I hear that he could be difficult with other riders, but you guys have a thing. Yeah, we for sure have a thing. I don't think anyone would have expected this when we started, but it's just turned out into such an incredible thing. And I'm keeping him forever because I'm sort of his person and he's sort of mine. Absolutely. Even though... He can sometimes be not so attached, but he is very attached. What happens when Mo is retired after his last competition? He will just stay at the farm with Lark and Wilman and all of their family to be taken care of. This is where he's been for the last six years, and there's no better care than that, honestly. I gotta ask, he's going after that blue Gatorade. Yes. Does Mo have a favorite flavor? The blue one. The blue one's sure. the favorite. He can one drink too. a lot, but definitely the blue. And, and what does this week look like for you guys? When's your qualifier? Our qualifier is on Tuesday morning. Okay, and yeah. we're hoping for to go out with a win, right? Hopefully, but. At least I get to keep them, so that's all that matters. Absolutely. Man, blue Gatorade to start off this Monday morning. But, hey, we got to fuel up for the competition. Mo does anyways. It's going to be a big last one for him here at the World Championship Horse Show. Mo is thirsty. I mean, just down I mean. that entire bucket. I guess you got to hydrate before, Still going. <laughs> before the competition. <laughs>